Well, I studied finance and psychology in college, and while my career has been built on finance or in finance, the underlying notion of our psychological relationship with money has never left me. Everyone has a relationship with money. It can be a source of pride, a source of envy, a source of stability, and a source of stress. And our psychological relationship with money is really important in helping us understand what benefits or barriers we may have in getting to the point where we're able to live our best financial lives. As an example, most clients go to CPAs to get their taxes done instead of talking to their financial planner about taxes. So approaching someone with a holistic view on their entire financial picture is crucial in helping someone achieve their goals and dreams. I look at my client interaction as twofold. I am both a source of knowledge as well as a confidant and friend that can help, help the client with all of the things that they might need to do in order to adopt our recommendations in a seamless manner in their lives. My main goal in the first meeting is to understand where clients are coming from, understand what can't be put on paper, which is their goals, their dreams, their concerns. My intention is to have the first meeting be the start of a relationship, not the conclusion of a transaction. The aha moment with clients often comes when they realize that they have an opportunity to achieve things that they have wanted and dreamt about, but perhaps not fully understood the path to get there. And when we're able to illustrate how, through adequate tax planning and financial planning, we're able to help the client get to where they want to go, that is just a beautiful moment when they're so happy and so satisfied with the solutions that we're able to provide.